All right, welcome back to the Goalie Be a Pro. And honestly, we've been off to a bit of a stinky start here. Sub 900 save percentage. Our team is 8, 10, and 3, 26th in the league. We're going up against Vancouver here. However, we did already get some X factors, which is absolute heat. So if we go to our abilities, we got Sponge as the X factor. And I believe All or Nothing is the poke check one. Yeah. So that's new. Maybe that'll help the 74 overall goalie play better. I also feel like because of the franchise mode changes where the players get abilities dynamically throughout the sim, or I guess while playing, I didn't really think, I guess you can play games in franchise mode, I've just really never done it. Anyway, I feel like it was impossible to get abilities before. Not impossible, but difficult. And now we already have two. So, let's go and take on the Vancouver Canucks. Can we at least get in to the third period with like a one goal deficit. Is that too much to ask for? And there you go. There's your one goal deficit. Connor Garland scores on the power play. Keep the sim going. Shots are pretty even. So we're not getting destroyed. As they start to pull away. Troy Terry. It is a 1-1 hockey game. And yeah, we did kind of pull the shots back there. So that's good. Alright, now we just need to maintain. Alright, let's try to keep this 1-1 one, one even better. Absolutely even better. Silverberg, you legend. We're going in. Up by one. Alright, now I also need to play like not an absolute joke. Because my performances, even when we've been jumping in recently, have been subpar as being nice actually. So not only are we up by one, but we also get a power play to start here. And Thatcher Demko setting the tone with that glove stop. That logo is so cool. Nice play. Took a long time to get that shot off. This guy loves smothering the puck, eh? Even if it's risky, you're supposed to pass it out. That's like an unwritten rule of the Chell video games. You pass the puck out as a goalie. Here we go, Frankie. Oh, almost got rocked there, but finds Henrique, who tries to go in the middle and winds up losing it to Vancouver. JT Miller just got rocked behind the scenes there. How much time is that? Four seconds? Oh my word! What is going on? Players are getting dropped left, right, and center in this one. Physical contest. If you guys want to just like keep the puck down there and stop me from getting any shots, that's totally cool by me, you know? I don't know how many shots they have up till this point. 3-7 just saved my life. No way! That was not a penalty. That is outrageous. I got to see the replay on that. See if maybe... There was some foul play that I did not see, but I think this was clean. McTavish, after saving me from a surefire goal, goes and takes a penalty. Okay, yeah, you know what? Maybe that was a bit of a charge. Fair enough, referee. Love save right off the draw there. There was an update this morning. They did not fix the ability to dump the puck at all. That was still pathetic. All right. They are setting up shop here. Hughes to Besser. Almost got tipped. In fact, I think it did get tipped. It just did not go towards the net. That was also tipped. Smother, smother, smother. Exactly what he just said. Exactly. No goal. Makes the dramatic save. Come on, ref. Yeah, he literally just ran into me. Kick him out, actually. Unbelievable. Are they even reviewing it, or is it just no goal? Oh, alright. <laughs> even better. Quinny. Oh my, like, why is there just so many big hits in this game? I am here for it, don't get me wrong. But that doesn't mean I can't ask questions. Just five seconds left on the power play. Kuzmenko gets pinned, and that is going to come to Jamie Drysdale. He makes a great breakout pass. Alright, so just like that, we are back to five on five action. There is about 13 minutes remaining here, and our one goal lead still remains. <laughs> no, no, no. I saw Pedersen streaking for the net, and my life flashed before my eyes. Oh no, two on one. I'll take the shooter. That still almost found its way in the net. Kuzmenko's back at it again. He almost gets another one off there. Come on, win that battle. That's huge. Lacombe. No! <laughs> Sends it back to their point, man. Oh, my voice. Having an absolute howler. Okay. See?
Are you kidding me? That is the definition of unacceptable. I can't believe you've done this. All right, so our lead has disappeared. And now we're in one. Philip Ronick goes for a massive pass, but that will be intercepted by Braun. And now McTavish. In. Can he save the day again? Good pass. Thatcher was with it the entire way, though. Wow, Beauvillier just got sat down. Can we not make passes right in front of me like that? You know, if we can avoid it, I would prefer to. I'll say that much. What am I doing? What am I doing? That was such pathetic positioning. It's situations like that where I find tethering to be the most difficult. Because I feel like if I was able to freely skate there, I for one wouldn't have automatically hugged the post. I don't know if I can turn that off or not. But yeah, I guess like I could have just let go and kind of let the goalie backskate. Would have been backed up right into the goal line at that point, which obviously is also not ideal. Also, I guess even in that situation, I probably could have flying poke checked. It would would have worked out. Puck meets Irene. Oh, you are really trying on that one, eh? Send it out. Screw it. All right, well, we came into this third period up by one. And after a few unfortunate events, we find ourselves down by one. Did I save that? My positioning was also not very good there. Ilya Mikhaev got leveled. He went to take the shot and he paid for it. Here we go, guys. Oh, no. They kept it in. All right. They have it down low. Whoa. They're moving way too quick now. They are moving mad, actually. Hag with it. Somehow manages to keep it. Guys, just get it out. I appreciate you. However, they are coming right back. Vesa rips one just wide of the net. Jamie has it. Battling. And he wins that battle. Silverberg steps by his guys somehow. With a little fake there. Strom right to Hughes. And here we go again. Pedersen over to... Yeah! See, I guess you can flank poke check in a lot of situations. Why did Fowler not cover the guy in front of the net? He literally just stood there twiddling his thumbs. Ten seconds remaining. Come on, let's get a last second goal here. Are you going to pull me or no? I don't know how to do it manually. And it's not asking me to come to the bench. So, whatever. No! Big save. That will conclude this game. Unless he's not even going for the shot. Anyway, they did have 38 shots. So, I had my guy. 3-7-1. What a bad record. Conversation with our coach. Probably another promise failure, I would imagine. Saying I can't stop a beach ball. We need wins right now, and that is not happening. You are correct. That is, in fact, not happening. I find it very difficult to argue against you. We are not in against the Caps, and Gibson gets us a dub. That is solid. We are now playing the Colorado Avalanche, where I will sim this one. 1-1. One, 3-2. One. What a game. Another conversation with the coach, eh? What's up? How would you rate your season so far? Like, mediocre at best? I'm not worried about the Calder Trophy race. Yeah, well, you've made that evident. All right, we have to win three of the next five hockey games. That's doable. Maybe. Not in this time against the Avs. And we get another dub. All right. Chicago is struggling. 7-16-1. Yes! Wow, we are really turning this ship around. You know, not starting again against the Winnipeg Jets. And it's another W. All right. Slowly climbing the standings here. Can we also beat the New York Islanders? No. No, we cannot. Will we be in for the Rangers game? Yes, we are. We need wins. And this would be a good way to start. Fire me vertical, Mr. Silverberg. Okay, well, they... Is, is it done? You guys done yet? I, every time I go to say something, I feel like, okay, there it is. Vinny Trocek scores as well. It is a 2-2 hockey game with not a lot of shots. And Barkley Goudreau just adds to it. It is a 3-2 hockey game here. They only have 20 shots. Come on, man. Five minutes to go. Before we jump in, will it be a one-goal deficit? Yes, it will. 
Let's do this thing. Come on, ducks. We need to get some W's. We actually somehow started to pull it back on the back of John Gibson. Artemi Panarin, his shot will be scary. But a big save, I should have smothered that. But alas, I did not. Kreider goes behind the net, up high. He even does the kick, really? Okay, that's cool. I'm kind of glad I got scored on by him. Wow. Another game full of massive hits. Lindgren. Oh my, just like, stop. Honestly, get off the ice, Zib. I still do think that our overall is not helping. Like that first goal there. If I had better rebound control. Also, if our defense were there to get the person in front of the net, but... I won't talk about that part, other than the fact that I just did. Lafreniere loses it. Truba. Guys. Okay, you know what? Yeah, this is where I just reset. And I gotta take my hand off. I'm learning, alright? You know when you go somewhere and someone has a name tag that says, like, in training or something on it? Right there. Number 5-3. Oh! I actually saved a breakaway without a flying po check. Kind of fired me up a little bit oh that is unacceptable i'm going for a scrap is it igor if it is it's about to be lights out for you pal oh that almost went in i feel like was there like an invisible barrier preventing it from going in it is igor okay so dodge come on come on get at me here he's gonna throw a punch right away and oh, okay i mistimed it but i won't mistime this one do it again Throw an uppercut, actually. Let's do something crazy. Ooh. Oh. Ole. See you later. I barely got touched on that one. Get out of the way, 8-1. You too, 6-1. People love standing in my way. After fights. Like, did you see what I just did to that guy? Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Thank you, Sevens. That was a legendary play. Are we going to win the battle as well? Yes, we are. Frankie. What a legend. If we would have scored there off that pass too, he would have been cemented in history. Holy, do you guys see that shot? Because I didn't. What a bullet. These hits are immaculate. Like, people are just dropping like flies. Nice pass. To Frankie. Igor is just too good. That is... A fact. Nice keep. The pressure right now is insane. We are all over this team. Another one! And Igor making a massive glove save. They still can't get it out. Braun, down low! Come on, guys! We have to score here. How do we not? That is brutal. Absolutely brutal. Yes! Finally! It wasn't even with all the pressure built up and our players circling their zone like sharks. But a goal is a goal. Brett Leeson receives the puck off of... Did he even pass there or did he just get hit? I think he kind of just got hit. We take those though. Ooh. That was going top cheese. We still got four minutes left, guys. We could tie this thing up. And honestly, the way that we've been playing, wouldn't be surprised if we do. Leeson's out there. He did it once, he can do it again. Whoa! That was insane. Will I actually get to touch the puck here? No! I was so close! Here comes Miller to Philip Heedle. Tried to get the shot off, but the defender was in the way. We now have 45 seconds left. Didn't really do much with that rush. Basically just donated the puck right back to the Rangers. Nice pass! That was it. That was our chance. Great, so now we need to win three of the next four games. That is going to be quite the task. Oh! Are you kidding me? 0.2 seconds left! You absolute beauticians. I thought it was over. I was done. I still... I... 
can't speak and don't believe it. Both of those things are true. So now we have three on three action. That was a simple save from an Adam Fox wrist shot. Let's go! Drysdale! Yeah! <laughs> Let's go! We need to win two of the next four, baby! I think he took the shot from the point too. Jamie Drysdale. Just give him all the abilities. Bump him up to 89 overall immediately. What a legend. Did not see that coming. It was such a cheeky goal too. He did go five hole. Five hole goals are the best. And not only that, but he also ran right into him. And the post and the crossbar just pretty much ran into everything. Coach feedback isn't too bad. The 882 save percentages, however, that was a massive win. We are now 14, 12, and 3 going up against New Jersey. Gibson is. Gets us another win. We're climbing. Back-to-back -back nights and we're not in again. And another victory. We are really turning this season around. Let's hear it. Oh, it's this again. Okay, never mind. Allow a max of four goals over the next two games? Who do you think I am? I'm probably going to let in four goals this game. There you go. We're already at two. And we're already at three. And we are at five. Sorry, coach. Oh, my word. We just lost two games in a row with Gibson and Nett. 16, 15, and 3. Wasn't Arizona doing really well to start? Well, it doesn't matter, does it? Because we're jumping into this game regardless. Unless it is a blowout. Then we might as well just sim the whole thing. But let's go. Can we not? Wow, another goal. You know what? I'm just simming the whole period. 3-1. And it is 3-1. I'll jump into the next one. Last time I went into the overtime, it did not work out in our favor. So I'm going to do this. Shootout. Oh, so close. And now I'm going to have to have a conversation with the coach about my lack of promise keeping. Okay, never mind. I did not get roasted yet. But we have been given a new challenge to win the next game because we have lost five in a row, apparently. Can we just have a close game going into the third period? That's a fair ask. And Patrick Kane on the Toronto Maple Leaf scores to make it 1-0. Cam Fowler comes right back though. Tied up yet again. Power play for the Ducks. Five on three and we can't score and then they get one. What a joke. Another power play. This is the most undisciplined team we have ever played. And we are still losing 2-1. All right, well, here we go. Not only are we down by one, but I'm also going to have to go up against Matthew Schatz, Patrick Kane Schatz, and just his filthy mitts in general. Riley goes in the middle. That's a good start. That could have been an even better start. So close. That looks like a bit of a trip there, ref. All right, I know you are the official. I'm just stating my case. Two saves on Nylander now. Smother it. No, never mind. Because Drysdale picks it up and now he's battling behind the net. Frankie. Get rid of it. What are you doing? Holding on to that puck for dear life. And if we get scored on because of this, I am going to be rather upset. No. All right. We got it out. That's good at least. Kelly Yarncrook. He's going to take the shot. I knew it. Read him like a book. They do still have possession, though. They're setting up. Yeah, I'll pass it out. Why not? Famous last words. Those three. He's had three players follow him. It's a good goal. It's a good goal. Thought he was going to shoot it. He didn't. And he went backhand. Well played, Morgan. Right about there is where... Would you see his little stick for like half a second? Just snap to forehand. I bit hard on that and then... <laughs> Why did that even happen? That doesn't even make sense. I suppose I could have flying poke checked him. But I wasn't thinking about that at the time. Aw oh, man, coach is going to kill me. Tavares got rocked. 
Now Braun goes to take a shot. Deflected and just wide of the net. We still have possession. I like it. Okay. Let him cook. Nice try. Apparently you can get a penalty in this game now for basically intentionally playing keep away in your own zone. So that's kind of cool. You get to delay a game. And yeah, I remember that doing that in like hut was a meta. You just get the lead, bring it back to your own zone and pass it around. I haven't played online NHL in forever. I might this year because my one friend is thinking about getting a PS5 in NHL. So I might start doing some ESHL again, which I am hyped for, by the way. Oh my. Okay, stop sliding around. <laughs> stop flopping around like a fish out of water and just settle. Willie again. They are just on what feels like non-stop attacks here. There is still eight minutes remaining. So, we're not out. I did count us out last game and we all saw how that ended. And we are about to go to the power play. So that improves our chances even more. Come on, come on. Oh my, like why did you hustle that hard to get that? You don't trust me? Fair enough, actually. Yeah, I don't trust me either. Yeah, so basically after this game, we're going to get roasted and toasted for about 10 minutes while we go through each of those promises that we failed. They killed off that power play with ease. That's not a good sign. Strom and Zegris with an incredible passing play. We're back to within one. After what happened last game... Can't rule it out. Look at that, though. The give and go. Mike Murphy didn't stand a chance in net there. Boom. And boom. Beauty. They almost came back and scored right away. That has to be a penalty of some kind, no? I feel like he got rid of the puck like 10 years ago. No, so close. We almost tied it up already. We didn't have to have the stress of a 0.2 seconds left goal. Nylander goes to Riley, who scored on me already in this. Wow, my positioning was awful. Thankfully, he missed the net, though. And here's Matthews. I feel like I've barely seen him. Oh, get real. Okay, well, now it's GG. 20 seconds left. Still down by one. I am ready for the coach to rip me a new one. Will I get one more shot? Yes, I will. Send it out just to end the game. Oh. We were doing well for a minute there. 36 shots, three goals. It's not too bad. Getting roasted, number one. Getting toasted, number two. Oh, I guess we kicked out at two. There was no three count. I maybe haven't played five games yet. I feel like Gibson's record is actually going to be decent. Ours is awful, but he's getting a bunch of wins here. Why are we going in against the Carolina Hurricanes that are 24-15-1? Can someone riddle me that? Well, play one sim one. Martinook scores already. That is the Scott Sterling special. Gets scored on instantly. one nothing after one. It is 2-2 two -two after two. 4-2. Four -two. Nice. I still don't think we won three games. So, this might be the three count. Yeah. Well, we got up to a 900 save percentage, apparently. So, let's find out which game we will be starting next. And then we'll go look at some stats. We are on a roll right now. Holy smokes. That's an L. And we fell back a little bit. But, 22, 17, and 5. Could be a playoff record if we keep up this pace. 23... Okay, Ducks, I see you. As of right now, we are fifth in the Pacific Division, but look at this. It is close. Sure, they have two games on us, but we have one game on them. And Vancouver has one game on us as well at 57 points, so I think it's safe to say the Golden Knights are kind of running away here. But other than that, it's anybody's game. The Golden Knights are actually first in the NHL right now with a record of 30-12-4. and That is good. I guess Zegers got hurt for a bit. But he is point a game right now. 36 games, 37 points. We also have 37 points from Terry. And Strom has 34. McTavish. So they're doing all right. Let's see this guy. Gibson. 
Yeah, he is killing it. 16, 8, and 3 with a 915 and 283. That's why our record is respectable at all. Whereas me, I'm nice and two with a shutout, to be fair. 900 save percentage three. You know what? Backup number is not horrible. We just need to get more wins. Thatcher Demko leading the league with 26. I feel like he was leading last time we checked to you. He has a 910. 920 for Jakey O. I'll mark a 925. Robin Leonard down there. I see you. Check out some defensemen in the league. EK65, 52 points in 46 games. What a mad lad. He actually has the second most points in the entire NHL. No, he's tied with McDavid. But... McDavid has four less games, so there's that. And then Patrice Bergeron, that shouldn't be here, but he is, has 51 points in 46 games. Nas with 50 points. Interesting. All right, we will face off against the New York Rangers, which is a pretty big game because they are 12th and we are 14th. So could be a shift in the standings here. And yeah, I just appreciate you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you could like, that'd be awesome. If you could subscribe, that'd be even awesomer. And I will see you soon.